Good morning, uh, friends. Welcome to Remember Math TV. Today, I'm going to sh uh, discuss how to solve the fifth word problem. So, this is my word problem. Three brothers are to share 80,000 pesos. The first brother will receive one half, while the second will receive three eighths. What amount will the third brother receive? So, I have here two types of solution. So, I'm presenting to you the solution one. So, as you can see, there are three variables A, B, and C. Uh, these variables represent the actual values. And if you add these actual values, they will give a sum of 80,000 pesos. And these actual values can be represented by fractions. So, 80,000 is represented by a number one. So, it means completeness. Okay, so C is represented by an unknown fraction. B is the actual value of B is represented by the fraction 3 8, and the actual value of A is represented by the fraction 1 half. Okay, so let us focus on this second equation. Uh, the, the equation that contains the fractions. So, as you can see, there are, there are two dissimilar fractions in the left-hand side of the second equation. So, let us uh, transform one half into uh, another form in such a way that there will be two similar fractions in the left-hand side. So, we have 4 eighths. So, since they are similar already, you can add 4 and 3, giving you a numerator of 7 with the same denominator 8. And because we want to solve the value of n, let us subtract 7, 8 from both sides of the equation. That will only uh, leave n as the term, as the only term. That will leave n as the only term in the left hand side. And in the right hand side, we have the fraction 1, 8. After, after subtracting 7, 8 from 1. So we have 1, 8. That is solution 1. And take note that C is equal to 80,000 times n. So, because we know that n is equal to 1 8, so we can multiply 80,000 by 1 8. So, the actual value of C is 10,000. So, let me present to you the solution 2. So, in uh, solution 1, we focus on the second equation. By this time, let us focus on the first equation where you can find the variables of the actual values. And 80,000 as their sum. So actually, A is equal to 80,000 times 1 half. And B equals to 80,000 times 3 eighths. So multiplying them, so you have the actual values. A equals to 40,000 and B equals to 30,000. So we know already the actual values of A and B. So we can add these pure numbers in the left-hand side, giving, you, giving us 70,000. And to solve for C, let us subtract 70,000 from each side of the equation. And the result is C equals to 10,000. Alright, so this is our conclusion. Very easy. Three brothers are to share 80,000 pesos. The first brother will receive one half while the second will receive three eighths. The third brother will receive one eighth, which is equal to 10,000 pesos. So thank you for listening friends. If some of you are new to my channel, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell for updates. Thank you for listening. May God bless you.